So, first line antiretroviral regimens for adults and adolescents are complete. We have completed. Moving on. The second line ART regimens. If zidovudin, lamivudin, nevirap uh, plus nevirapin, ifavirens fails, or tenofovir, lamivudin, nevirapin fail, then they will include second line regimens where there will be a PI component. So, NRTI plus NRTI plus PI. This will be NRTI plus NRTI plus PI. Tenofovir, abacavir, etazanavir. Let's go and check back. Check tenofovir, abacavir, etazanavir. Okay. Tenofovir. What else did they say? Abacavir and a tazanavir that will be second line. So second line will be NRTI plus NRTI plus PI. It's not very difficult, right? Remember? What say guys? So just look at this. The easiest one for you is tenofovir, uh, lamivudine plus uh, any PI component. Here a tazanavir is first choice and this slash R means that it's a low dose ritonavir boosted. Okay. Atazanavir plus rito, uh, ritonavir. See here for nelfinavir, they didn't put slash R. That's why, you know, for nelfinavir, ritonavir will not do anything. Indinavir, lopinavir. Okay. So, here you have uh, NRTI component. Tinofovir, abacavir, etc. Guys, is this clear? See, the whole message finally is that First line will be NRTI plus NRTI plus NNRTI. Second line will be NRTI plus NRTI plus PI. Okay. So, this one you remember. First line NRTI, NRTI, NNRTI. Second line NRTI, NRTI, PI. PI also two will be there. If it is nelf Nelfinavir, then only one will be there. But if it is others, there will be a small uh, dose of uh, Ritonavir also be given. So, that it can do give a boost to the PI regimen. What else? Finally, you should just remember one thing. What? R virus can be suppressed. HIV can be suppressed so that it will not become a full-blown AIDS. So, there is, that's a good thing that HIV has a lot of research and they are trying to find out a lot of cure and at least we have things to suppress the disease. Okay? What else? We have to also look at prophylaxis, okay? That is pre-exposure prophylaxis and post-exposure prophylaxis. So, to prevent the disease, if the person hasn't been exposed at all, uh, I mean, uh, basically, it's not like he's not exposed at all, but he's not, like people who have uh, sex with men, sex workers, injection users, they are pre-exposure people. Post-exposure will be people who have a needle prick injury like a doctor or a nurse, okay, for them. So, this also we have to look at. We will look at this um, now or later. Anyways, we will just look at this. Tenofovir plus emtricitabine for um, pre-exposure. For post-exposure, let's say you yourself get a needle prick injury. What will you do? You will give tenofovir emtricitabine plus, okay, you will give Lopinavir, etazanavir, okay, with ritonavir, uh, low dose, okay. So, this much preferred at least you remember, guys. Here it is tenofovir plus emtricitabine plus or minus. Here, same thing, tenofovir, emtricitabine plus you will add one PI, okay. Dose, if you want, you can remember. As of now, we are not going to focus on the dose, but if you want, you can remember that, okay. That's all for now, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.